Good morning, this is Louise Soho coming to you on a rainy, gloomy day in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. So I'm going to get ready and I'm going to be cutting up some collard greens. Making me some, they call, the southern folks call them slickums. I'm going to be cooking some slickum collard greens. So I'm going to be getting these ready to cut them up. They've been washed. See the water dripping, they've been washed. I washed them. I'm going to be getting ready to slice them up there. I have some. I'm showing you how you see the water leaking. I don't wash them. I'm getting ready to just cut them up. And you'll see how I do that in the moment. Fresh collard green. I'm going to be cutting those stems right there off. to the side. I'm going to take these and I'm going to roll them like so I can cut them up. Small on like to cut big. I like to cut small. So I cut them and they cut real small. They are cut real small. This how my mother and my grandmother them taught me how to cut them up small. When I'm doing my greens. Turn them to muscle. These are collard green, and I'm gonna cook them as slick. Knife is real sharp because I have my father to sharpen them. I gotta be careful so I won't cut myself while I'm cutting the green. Okay. I'm finished my first bundle, cut it up. Okay, I'm 
getting ready to cut up my greens. I'm going to be doing some collard greens for dinner today. Need some collard greens. So I was getting them ready and preparing them. So I'm going to get ready and I'm going to cut them up. I'm rolling them. Rolling them to slice them up. Okay, I'm finished cutting up the collars. I'm going to be cooking them in a little bit and I got to get ready and get my meat ready and clean it out. My collard greens that I'm going to be doing today. Okay, this is my meat for my um, greens, my smoked riblets that I will be putting into my greens. So I'm getting ready to get this ready to go in the pot and boil my pressure pot and I also okay these are my potatoes for my candy ham that I'm gonna get ready to peel yeah, and I'm gonna get them ready I have two of these big yams right here that I'm gonna be slicing and chopping Slice and these up. cutting in chunks for my candy yams I'm gonna make some Good old candy yams with these two taters. So I'm getting ready to um, peel these and chop it up and I'll be back. Okay, you see me peeling these big old yams. They hard to cut, but I'm slicing them anyway. I got potato peelers. I'm so used to using a knife. Though. And it's good and sharpened too. So I'm just peeling them so I can make some yams with these two potatoes. That's one down. One more to go. Okay, I have my potatoes peeled. Now I'm going to cut them into yams and get ready to caramel them down into some good old vanilla flavored candy yams. Okay, I have cut up the yams ready. They are chopped up, so I'm getting ready to wash them real good. Rinse the water. Get ready and make my yams. These are my collard greens that I'm getting ready to fry. And get ready to prepare them on the oven, on the eye, so you see the difference.